Now, your weather alert forecast. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm 3 News Now, meteorologist Mark Stitz. We'll continue to dodge more of those scattered showers and thunderstorms through the rest of the afternoon, but temperatures should still manage to make it into the low and mid 80s. That's thanks to those breezy winds out of the south pumping the heat and the humidity in. Now, when dry, we'll continue to see mostly cloudy skies. Early tonight, a few more spotty showers and thunderstorms for us to dodge, and by 10 o'clock, we'll be dipping down into those mid and upper 70s. We keep it pretty mild then heading into Tuesday morning, only dipping down to about 70 degrees with a few more spotty showers, but I think most of us should be dry for the Tuesday morning commute. Then mostly dry for your afternoon on Tuesday. A little bit more sunshine that will once again get us right back in those mid 80s, even without those stronger wind gusts that we're going to see today and tonight. So temperatures top out near 84, those scattered showers and storms. When dry, which will be plenty of good portion of the day, will be mostly cloudy. Overnight tonight, still breezy out there. A few more spotty storms will only dip down to about 69. So warm start to our Tuesday and tomorrow afternoon. A little bit above average for this time of year. We'll see highs near 86, a mix of sun and clouds. Wednesday, same thing. Most of us are dry, but a couple isolated storms will be out there. Hot and humid, though, for most of us. Highs near 89. But Thursday morning, our next cold front arrives. That's going to bring with it a number of showers and storms. Right now, it looks like most of that will be in the morning, with much drier weather in the second half of the day with highs in the low 80s. Then the comfortable air arrives for Friday. That's going to allow us to drop down into the upper 50s in the morning, only mid-70s in the afternoon with lots of sunshine. And hopefully, we can keep that dry weather going for the first half of the weekend. Temperatures in low 80s for the Huskers down in Lincoln.